My name is Mary. I'm from Wahoo. Dear my anxiety, you ruin my life. You ruin my every single day. Just like that, constantly worrying if I get this information for a test. Worried about it for two weeks, in fact. Well, I got the results. Did not get that information. I should have known. Maybe I did. Maybe that's why I couldn't stop thinking about it. Maybe my anxiety was right. I forced myself to sit in class every single day. I'm wasting my time. I might as well just play hooky. If my stupid sponge of a brain is absorbed with only anxiety to soak in anything useful, instead, full of these useless worries, did that customer not tip me last night because I was not a good waitress? Did I not have a date to prom because I'm annoying? Did Melanie not say hi to me because she hates me? Why can't you just leave me alone? You're holding a rope to me that's tied to my hands. The knot is too tight. I can't undo it. The tug of war is nothing like a children's game. It's like you're a person I just can't stomach, can't seem to find likable qualities in. You're always there, so needy. I can't escape you. You're rude, too. Interrupting my every time I speak, or think, or breathe, every thought. If your worries are more important than my thoughts, it seems. Anxiety. I can see it clear as day. People are avoiding me. You know what? You're just a cracker crumb to me. I will crush you into a million pieces. I think it's your fault. They don't, act, they don't know how to act around me. I'm sorry I'm sad. What do you want me to do about it? Faith says, God helps me to see that it's only the anxiety talking. It's only ever the anxiety. It's only ever been the anxiety. Separate from me. I'm suffering, God. I'm suffering. I'm going to fight my hardest and have a feeling of content at the end when I win. <laughs>